Okay, alright, it's all working right there. It's both Discord. Do -do -do. How's it going, Carl? Right, I think we're good. How's it going, Rob and Daisy? <clears throat> Doop -do. So I had to create the character beforehand, so I actually have a recording of that but i had to they, they they suggested i create my character yesterday just to make sure that i have access a though i think if you go there you can still technically sign up and get access to this on pc go to the main website uh this is a weird thing because i can't just capture the game i actually have to capture screen capture so this is the uh Actual intro. Our lives. I didn't realize I had to remove that right away. A long path. But eventually, all roads reach their end. How's it going, Steve and Shabab? Our world is broken. Stagnant, fallen into the abyss. But everything is born from darkness. Even the universe itself. I don't use VLC now. <laughs> now, do you see though. it? A glimmer within the void. The spark of life still burns, and evolution forges a new way forward. Once your faith overcomes despair, once you move beyond death, once life returns to this world. We'll meet beyond that path. Okay, so that was the intro. Uh, like I said, I had to create my character beforehand. And they give you a good... Good amount of character creation. You can choose like all the different types of, you know, uh, however you want the cheekbone, jawline, all that jazz. Mess around with that. You can change your hair color, your hairstyle. You know, do do the normal things of creating a character. So I went through and kind of created my own character. And then I was like, oh, they got the they got the thing from. Uh... Oh, I can't even remember what the movie's called right now at the top of my head. It reminded me of, uh, uh, Orange something. Is it Orange? I don't remember what it's called. And there's, like, Character Creator, and then after you create your character, there was one more part I wanted to, I recorded it for. Right here. Yeah, it's open world survival.
This is one of the zombie games. I mean, kind of zombies, but it's it's more like Lovecraftian style type of creepy stuff. How's it going, Toyota? By the way, I didn't, I didn't say that. <laughs> Forgot to had that tab open. The creepy voice could piece the heck out of you. That'd be that would be a bit unsettling. Just wake up tripping out. Some sort of weird stuff in us. Yeah, I figured to record all this stuff, because why not? Why not? That way you could see the intro and I don't have to, like, do it. Why did I skip it and show it now? I, I had to. I had to, like, uh, they they said basically you want to make sure to create, because it's like the first 150,000 people that sign up for it get access. I think I had access no matter what, but they suggested that we just create our character right away when the servers opened last night. So I, I couldn't stream then. It was too late in the day. I felt like this is the perfect time. So I recorded that part so that way you guys could still at least see the intro of the whole thing. And that's where we are now, because we're here. So, I haven't done anything past that point. I literally created my character and left it at that, basically. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know anything else past that point. Researcher. Oh, just gonna be like little lore notes and everything. Okay. So, there's an access code 0728. Do I have to remember that? Oh, no, it tells me up there. Okay. As we're currently tracking your display at the top left corner of your screen. 0728. Alright, find the access card and enter the research lab to obtain Cradle. I'm assuming that's where I need the research lab. Alright, I did it. Yeah, the intro was cool. That's one of the reasons why I was like, really, I was like, uh, since I gotta create this, let's just record. That way I can at least still show it in the stream. Yeah, I think it's just like multi-dimensional in a sense, too. And they, I guess they made it so that there's PvE servers and PvP servers. And I am on a PvE server because I do not like PvP. I believe that there is like still places that you can I don't know if it's still in this thing right now, but I know there's places that you can access PvP at originally. I don't know what all has changed. Hello little bird thing. Well it's good to see another face. I thought I was on my own. Yeah. I had the screen capture, so you'll see every time I alt tab out, I'm sorry, I don't have a choice. This is Vulcan Vulcan engine or something and so it something about Vulcan the OBS does not track right so yeah that's a thing and you're a metahuman too um am I <laughs> I don't know who you are but I know what you are you awakened the cradle and that's something only a metahuman could do do you remember who you are nope no idea <laughs> it must have been that fluctuation just now it trapped me in the cradle it could have robbed you of your memories. You can call me V. It seems that our interests are aligned, Metahuman. All right. And who are you? Why are you here? Where were we, where were we here? I came to secure a deviation, a paper butterfly. But I think something must have scared it. <laughs> that shake, I know. It's amazing. Right now, though, we need to move. I can show you the way out of this place. But only if you help me complete my mission first. All you have to do is listen to what I tell you. Okay. In we go. All right, I'm assuming glowing thing. FaceTime scanning for hidden objects and tagging things. Oh, okay. Fucking great. All right, cool. With ranged weapons and melee weapons at once, use a shortcut to switch between the two. I only have one, so yeah, I only have melee. 
pounding? Why does the blade look all bloody? <laughs> what? Okay, I can just bring it out right away. Alright, good, good, good. Alright. Yeah, I've been I've been really looking forward to playing this. I was I was super disappointed I couldn't get into the last beta. Are you you're bad, I'm assuming. Oh, I could have backstabbed. It's been infected with Stardust. It's called a deviant. Our world has been overrun with deviants ever since Starfall. Ordinary humans can't take high levels of Stardust exposure. When they do, they end up just like but you're a metahuman. It disappears. You should be fine. In fact, if the conditions What's are going right, with you might even be able to use Stardust to your advantage. Let's go, man. All right, give me that activator, sure. I don't know what the activator is. Press Q to use space time to search for items in the monolith. All right. Oh, there's the thing over here. Do 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 you. All right. I got myself a hat. Okay, so we got our backpack. Armor you currently have equipped is displayed. Okay, that's fine. <coughs> oh. Sorry. Cradle. There's like a whole building aspect to this too, like most survivals and everything. Which is awesome. And I believe it's like you build a base, you can take it wherever. Like, hey, you want a base over here? Here's a base over here. You know, it's kind of like the Fallout 76 style type of base where you can just move around. Hmm? Now it's going to be found scattered around the world. Read them to learn more. I think they also, don't think they give you experience? Maybe not. I don't know. Uh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Am I in danger? I am in danger. Let's go, man. Give me the good. All right. I'm getting all these activators. I'm assuming that's healings. How's it going, B. Pinnaton? <laughs> uh, hey, I got boots. I have shoes. I don't run around barefoot anymore. <laughs> Hello? Okay. Eh? Official fluctuations often cause anomalies in time, allowing past scenes to be witnessed once again. Activate space time to locate spatial theaters. Events and people from the past may reappear, potentially revealing hidden truths. All right. My name is Victor Hammond. What's your name? I don't know. I just know I'm a monster. My mom, my dad, they're gone. It was all my fault. Hey, hey, try and stay calm. I'm here to help you. No one can help me. It would be better for everyone if I just... Just leave me alone, please. I'm afraid I can't do that. And you're not a monster. In fact, you're very, very special. You just need to learn how to control your own strength. Once you do that, you can help fix this broken world. We can do that together. Yeah, for me, it's 1 p.m. right now. <clears throat> All right. My butterfly, it's flying. Yes. First deviation. And look how gentle it is. I remember my name mm. now. It's Mitsuko. It means child of light. It's my first creation. I will create more. It resembles a lot like death. Uh, it, it had the same kind of vibe as Death Stranding at moments when I saw it and I saw little bits of it during the last alpha. Alright. We need something powerful to challenge the evolutionists. I think I've finally found it. You, we can secure other deviations. We can use them to forge a new path. This will be the Mayflies' mission. This is why we'll fight. Mayflies? That's right. Mayflies. Small, yet invincible. What? <laughs> I feel like weird things are happening. I mean, it's still a beta and everything. <clears throat> All right. Uh, goodies to craft with, I'm assuming. Okay, so now I'm, I guess I gotta go down here. All right, Badoop, give me whatever this is. You gonna give me gloves? Cause this is the only thing I don't have. Nope. Open. 
Okay, maybe not. Was there another direction? Oh, there is over here. All right, that guy is what? Okay. Crazy head. Control. All right, well, I'm going to open this first. How's it going, Jarla? Yep, there's gloves. All right. <laughs> I was going to say, this is the only thing that I didn't have. What is this? Ooh, what am I doing? Use it to shoot things? Okay. All right. Am I good? Hey, buddy. We found I'm using this guy's head as hand. a weapon now. See if you can feel the rhythm of it. Then try and secure it. Eh? How do I put this guy? There we go. Butterflies emissary. Okay. What am I doing now? Alright. How's it going, Bubba? <clears throat> Okay. Here's a lot of fun. I have been having... I, I actually, earlier this morning, basically got my daughter on the bus this morning at 8 o'clock. From pretty much 8 o'clock until about noon, I was playing High Engineer, doing, working on the next video. I it probably won't be up tomorrow, but it'll probably be up the next day. Okay, open door. What is happening? Enter the house in front of you to see if it's occupied. Why do you have all these turrets facing this way? Wait, I think I've seen part of this. Real estate simulator? I actually was recording before this. I just didn't finish it yet. Territory cores? Okay, I'm supposed to go talk to you. Is this gonna be like one of the faces I can make? Okay, talk to you. Eh. <laughs> I feel like I don't walk as far. I'm gonna stop instantly when you're walking. You're still alive! Yes, and look what I found. A meta. Only just woke up. They were kind enough to activate the cradle and set me free. Thank you, MetaHuman. This means a lot to me. You can call me Mitsuko. I used to be a MetaHuman as well. Rosetta did all kinds of experiments on me. That is, until V saved me. Mitsuko is a very special Meta. She can sense even the tiniest fluctuations in the Stardust. It's thanks to her that I was able to take refuge in this place after Starfall. You're safe here. Your butterflies deviation you're looking for? So basically, yeah, Starfall is apparently like some sort of crazy, well, I, I don't know much about it, I guess. About 20 years ago, Rosetta triggered a major stardust fluctuation during one of their experiments. As a result, some great ones slipped through, entering into our world. They brought increased levels of stardust with them. That poison has seeped into every corner of our world now, spawning countless deviants. And other dangers. It's thanks to her that I was able to take refuge in this place after Starfall. So yeah, basically it's like it's something safe. happened and everything. Every, every every the whole world basically got mutated by this stuff, like the old ones. And it, it talks it talks about them like they're old gods, like Lovecrafty in nature. Yes, an emissary of sorts. I wanted it to help rescue other metas. The recent fluctuation must have startled it. The important thing right now is to secure it. See that thing in the center of the room? It's a device for securing deviations. This makes them more useful and safer to be around. Okay. You can see a creepy white dress girl with a creepy horse that's going off. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Paper, but they can fight alongside you. Use it to mark the enemy's weak spots and increase weapon, weapon damage. All right. Deposit. The butterfly is recovered. I think right. it likes you. Cool. Yeah, see, it's like when you move, you, there is no momentum. Like, you stop, you stop. 
it, it it's it's weird. I'm not used to that in a lot of games. Normally, you still kind of have a little bit of momentum. Deviations can be very dangerous if not taken care of. They can radiate stardust, which can lead to all kinds of unpredictable consequences. And this is why we created the Mayflies. We make cradles and securement units to keep deviations contained. We're trying to find ways for humans and deviations to live in harmony. We figure this is our best chance of cleaning up the mess that Rosetta made. Uh, ba -da -ba -ba. All right. Like <laughs> we don't actually say anything. We just kind of shake our shoulders. No one's exactly sure what they are. Just that they're not bound by the physical laws of our world. They came from another dimension. Something we call rift space. When deviations get stressed, they release stardust. We think this brings our world and rift space closer together. Like with Starfall, sometimes it becomes possible to pass between the two planes of existence. And when that happens, all hell breaks loose. Alright, so what are you trying to do? Some deviations are friendly, like the butterfly. But others, like the ones inside monoliths, are extremely dangerous. It's not practical to secure all of them, of course. But if we can learn more about them, maybe we can find ways to live alongside them. That's the goal. Also, the stardust just keeps spreading, and we aren't sure why. A spine chilling roar. <laughs> Shit, it must have gone through. Come on, Meta. A deviation from another world just entered this space and it won't go down without a fight. Take the butterfly with you. It can help. Okay. I'm um, taking you with me. Uh, withdraw. Okay, cool. Uh, ba -da -ba -ba. Equipment box. You want me to do a whole bunch of things. Do this. Weapon crate. Uh, I got a jacket. Gotta equip it. Okay, so it definitely seems like it's better than what I was currently wearing. Okay. What? Top mods. Oh, okay, you can apparently put mods on everything, too. Let's go to MDR. Or needs to land on something. <laughs> I mean, I didn't get pants, right? No, I didn't. I'm still currently wearing this. Is this going to give me pants? Nope. Alright, stuns of rocking around in this. Uh, what's this? Emergency med kit. Alright, sanity gummies. Anything else in here I should be getting? No, that's just lower. Alright, I'm going back down here. What do you want me to do here? Facility. I don't want to put it in there though, do I? Why do you keep telling me to do this? Closet. Okay. Ability? Synchronized to cradle. There we go. Special type of deviation is aggressive, but it's can fully controlled by meta humans in secure state. So yeah, the the girl I think is a is a meta human. <clears throat> yeah, they did experiments on her, so she's not human, fully human anymore. Okay. Control deviation, dormancy threshold, handling. Nice button on the interactive screen. Uh, carrying out a competitive call of deviation wheel. Alright, cool. So we're synchronized, and I guess I'm good. Do I just leave you in here? Logging by hand, get logs. Alright, sure. Forms empty handing gathering less efficiently. Okay, cool. You just want me to come over to this? I'm just taking a rock and smacking a rock. Alright. So I got all that. Now I'm just gonna go smack a tree. Wait, that didn't that, that didn't work. Oh, it's smacking a small tree. I'll smack another small tree. T to set up a campsite. 
Okay, do I want to set it up up here? I feel like over there is where the bad things are coming from. There's lots of guns facing that way. Alright, well, I'm just going to put it right here. Simple crafting bench at the campsite to make basic gear, tools, and dishes. Good enough for emergencies. Okay. <clears throat> uh, craft with bare hands. Okay, weapon crafting. I'm making a... I can't even make a crossbow yet. Torch and a crossbow. Armor crafting. Can I make pants? Need hide. So what do you want me to make? Survival campsite, make a rusty crossbow. And survival campsite, crafted with bare hands, make an arrow. A rough pickaxe. Well, I need more wood, apparently. I, I, honestly, I didn't even notice the tree falling animation. Now <laughs> that guy hits the ground and it stops. Alright, craft with bare hands. Weapon and crafting. Oh, make me this. I've made myself a crossbow. Whip as primary weapon. And then I'm assuming arrows or there's a crude pickaxe. Capacity, so remember to retrieve your finished items. Okay. Oh, I need more stone for that. All right. And then arrows. I need more stone for that. Okay. We can look down the scope. This. Copper ore. You knock this giant tree down with a rock. Yeah, this game does have base building. You can build all, and the, the way the base building works, as far as I understand it, is it's basically like, so I build a base, you know, on the, the southern part of the map. We, we're done in the southern part of the map. We're continuing moving north. You can basically just take that base and just have it go bloop, and it's just down up into the northern part of the map. So, I mean, it, it's, it's movable. Which I, there's only been a couple games I can think of where that, that happens. And the one that stands out the most is, uh, you know, just normal stone here. I mean, there's copper, I guess. Maybe I'll get stone from there. Okay, it's giving me gravel. Um, well, at 76 does that, where you just, you're, you can build your base from wherever you build it. You can slap it down wherever you want, as long as it's not next to somebody else's. Yep, real estate simulator is tomorrow. I have that. I, I just need to finish when I'm done streaming today. And then... I don't remember what the other thing was. Yo. V-Sync not on? There is no V-Sync. Okay, gameplay. I uh, see no option for V-Sync. I don't know if the screen tearing is coming through for you guys, but it is for me. It's driving me nuts. There it is. What? I changed V-Sync on, and all of a sudden, the entire, like, outside here changed. All right. No, not yet. Uh, okay. What do I need? I still need to get stone, I think, maybe? I don't know. We're gonna see if we can make our stuff. Give me this. Wrapped up the crude pickaxe. Okay, and then I need to make arrows. Okay, there we go. So, equip a gathering tool before you start gathering resources. Much faster to do it barehanded and craft gathering tools at your camp. Okay. All right. I mean, yeah, I did that. Where does it go, though? Yeah, I know this is armor. Why do you keep showing me the armor? I get it. No, I don't. I don't want to change my new gear. It is my new gear. That's fine. Okay, wait. Where, where do I say gathering tool, though? I mean, maybe it's just in the hot bar. Oh, okay, yeah. I just, I just grab it on my hot bar. 
Okay, give me the arrows. Is that what I needed? You go crack down, crack down deviants. That mean. Fight. Oh, uh, everything just went crazy. Do not feel like they're enough. Alright, what's this? Arrows? Hey, I got a little bit more arrows now. Uh. I suppose to, can I use the these siren. things? So Alright, well, I don't. I feel like, I mean, I you know, want to do more damage than I thought it was. Would be. Now you'll see for yourself what it's capable of. Okay, that's right. That's right. Fall back. Teaching the plant face. All right, keep going back, thing. Video tower head man. Yeah, it's like, I like how it keeps saying you love Victor. Alright, and bam, you Victory! Alright. Why are you still glowing? Control and secure deviation that appears in front of you. Ooh. What is this? Festering gel? Okay, would you stop freaking out at the top of my screen? I don't know what's happening. Uh, okay. Hey, uh, it escaped, I guess? Damn. It escaped. Just driving it away was enough. And it's all thanks to you, Meta. You're tougher than you look. That's twice now you've saved me. Uh, the physical world? Is there, do you go there? I gotta go yes. kill it there now? Itsuko created this rift space. A refuge from the dangers of the physical world. Or so we thought. Do you think that deviation will come back? It's possible. We just can't sit here and wait, though. Meta, will you go back to the physical world with me? Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. Take the butterfly with you. Put it in your cradle. That way, I can lend you some of my strength. Hopefully we'll meet again one day. It looks like this is goodbye. Before you go, if you have any questions, I can try and answer them for you. Alright. So, withdraw you. Oh, there we go. Okay, press tab to select the camera to take a photo of video. You want me to do what now? Why? Why do I need to take a picture of you? Angle of view, hide, turn off, okay. Take photo. There you go, I did. I don't know why. I feel like I, I really need to save it to my album. Look, I did. I. Okay, you're a weird game. I don't feel like I needed to take a photo. I guess it's just a way to be like, hey look, you can do a photo mode. It's fun to transfer between things. It looks, looks like it feels great to transfer between realms. For, uh, yeah, and I, I'm, I'm not I'm not too surprised we didn't get a lot of stuff from them because that was I'm pretty sure this is just tutorial area. This dumps us out of the main world. Quite literally dumps us out. Years 
years after Starfall, and the world is still infested with Stardust. It looks like the Monoliths here have been reactivated too. They might hold the key to all this Stardust pollution. That... I don't know where I want to land. Is there a specific place I should, I should aim for? I think it looks like a place I probably eventually want to go to. The purple thing down here. Open my map. Oh yeah, and this is the map, by the way. I don't know exactly how much is here. No, I'm, I'm pretty sure at least all this. Like, it's a pretty big map, from my understanding. Okay, well, I mean... Level 2. Level 3. Level 4. Okay, so we probably want to go over here somewhere. Alright. I think these are all people's bases and stuff. Actually, that's what it's going to... A big chunk of it's going to come down to is I'm going to have to find a place to put my base. Now that we've made it, oh my gosh. The territory. Thing at the top of the screen, though. This is driving me nuts. Enter Victor Hammond. What? 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 On the basis of your territory defines area you can build. You're free to construct your home as you see fit within the area, and you have access to functions such as crafting, planting, assembly, and more. God, go away! What is this? I may have to like restart the server thing, I guess. Okay. Uh. Entered, you have left. You have entered, you have left. I don't know why it keeps telling me that. Hey, hmm. I don't know how big these spaces are on the building thing goes. Okay, so I can see right there. Uh, do do do. Your build mode. Oh, oh, interesting type of build mode. Okay, so I can just walk around and do all this. Okay, well, wasn't expecting that. Holy crap, alright, can I... I don't want to exit game. Self-destruct? Well, that's not good. All this now? Welcome rewards? Oh, yeah, there's a bunch of things. I don't know what these are. I don't know if I want to claim that yet. Yeah, that's what I'm kind of hoping. This is the building area right now. There. Okay, I was like, I don't. I'm assuming that there's going to be fall damage. Okay, so is this? I don't know. How do you? If they won't let me put it here, is there something here? This. Is that already here? That. I don't know if that's like my terminal or what. Every little flower thing. Okay, place the nexus to expand your area. Is nice that work. what I'm doing? I've did I just I just place the okay? If you access them through your cradle, you'll be able to craft and build what we need. Okay, well that's the thing that just happened. Didn't necessarily plan to build right here, but I've done it. This is where we built. Okay, copy, demolish. Get get out of the build mode for right now. Facility. <clears throat> so I guess I put this thing in here, right? Deposit. And then we use this. Synchronize. Okay, fatal flaw. All right, so that thing's like my buddy or something. So what is this? Details. Structures. Double those things, repair all. 
Hey, I, I don't, I don't know. Press tab to call out the function wheel and select the cradle to enter the mimic screen. Summon, survive, cradle. All right. Click the button. Oh, so this is my skill points and stuff. Various kinds of buildings and formulas can be learned from the mimic nodes. Okay, so we have smelting essentials, which gives us a furnace, copper ingot, charcoal, glass, disassembly, copper pickaxe. Okay, so I'm assuming that's what we're going to want to work on. Essential tools. Supplies, workbench, ammunition, which is going to be a thing I'm definitely going to want to make. Uh, then we got a farming thing, it looks like. Food, stoves, cooking, rainwater. Wait, do I have to learn cooking before I can do this? Dear God. I mean, I have nine, it says. Yes? Okay, so that's fine. I feel like cooking is probably something we should learn pretty quickly. Uh, I'm gonna do the smelting essentials. How about building? Is that the last thing here? Wood supports. Okay, here we go. So go ahead and unlock that. Uh, storage expansion. You should hoard things even with these crates so we can get some crates so I can have some storage. Sounds like a good idea. Oh, wait. It costs two for these. Eh, it's fine. Wood roofs. <laughs> Wait, doors and windows? I can't even make doors yet? Oh, no. That, that message is still going away. Oh, my God. Still going on. Okay, then open the mounting screen and unlock the disassembly. Oh, wait, wait. You wanted me to get the... I didn't do that, though. I didn't... I definitely did not do that. I did not see that it wanted me to get that specific one. Oops. <laughs> I'll get more ciphers eventually. It's fine, I guess. Um, I definitely did not mean to do that, though. Okay, so how do I choose what I want to build? That's what I'm really confused by this build menu thing. Open build menu. Right click. Okay, there we go. Like I don't, I don't know what you want me to do here. So I can't put more down because I'm missing gravel. Yeah. All right, that's fine. Get out of build mode. Assuming I can just come over here. Uh, the end. Okay. Well, that's minus. All right. Well, that's fine. Okay. So give myself some rock. Am I using the pickaxe to chop trees too? Banana tree. Okay. Guess so. We're using this pickaxe for everything. Alright, well, this is fine. Go back to building. Let me have a foundation. Okay, nope, that doesn't work like I thought. Interior. Door and design. Abilities. Furnace and a stove. Different lights I can place up. Prints. Oh, so I can, like, texture the ground? Wait. Oh, does it not cost me anything? I can just texture things however I want? Anytime I want? Really? Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that a lot. Alright, get out of all the building mode. There we go. I'm assuming killing and gathering probably helps get more ciphers. I hope. Because there is, like, a, if I look at the map, there's a little camp right here. And I believe, like, each one of these things have... Yeah, look for mythical crate, activate rift anchor, and find weapons and gear crates. This is obnoxious, though. Holy crap. Like, if I exit game, does it... Exit the game and, or log in again? Exit game. Relog in. Enter game. I just 
just want the thing to stop flashing on my screen that it's utterly obnoxious. Constantly telling me you injured X and injured X. Like, oh my god. Okay. Crypt opens ends in 59 days. I mean, I'm pretty sure this event or this this beta goes if I saw it right until the 30th. Okay. Huh, look, it's gone. It's not there anymore. Thank goodness. Okay, so I want to go to this place over here. Let's come back to my base at another point in time when I actually have things. Question is, how much ammo do I have? Okay, I got 30. At 30 rounds, hopefully that'll be good. Well, that didn't work. Eh, climb up here. There we go. All right, whatever this purple thing is, going towards it. Is this somebody's actual territory? No, there's bad guys right here. All right. Just grab everything. Alarm clock, materials. Oh, that's why I need the disassembler. I'm gonna do. Right? Oh my god. It's like loading everything in because I restarted the game. You not see me? Alright, cool, cool. What is this? Activate rift anchor? That dude. Look for Misty. Okay, apparently that's one of the things, the goals I was supposed to do here. You are parched. Oh. Eh. Uh. Boiled water. Oh, it's right here. Okay. Oh, I, I need food and water. Holy crap, I am starving apparently. And I am super dehydrated. Ah, the bad, the bad, bad. All right, none of that, man. Not dropping anything? I don't get any goodies. All right. Lantern. Trash can. I I saw something else, but I must have picked it up. Ooh, I didn't even see you there. Some good stuff here. Got some corn apparently. I wasn't even trying to get the corn. Storage crate. Uh, I mean, all that sounds good. I'm just gonna grab everything. I don't even know. Do I have a limit to how much I can carry? I do have a limit to how much I can carry. Oh no, grab it all. Take some more corn because I'm sure I could use that as food. I don't know what's on your head, but they seem to be super damaging. Okay, so as far as where we are right now. So it should be all inside this area. Over here, I'm assuming? Auto attack? Okay, so I got the little dude. Complete season goals. Eh? Oh. Oh, uh, must there's somebody else here, I think. Right? No, wait. Is my butterfly just murdering everything? I'm so confused what's happening. I think my butterfly is just a psychopath. Alright. That's fine. Whoa, what is hello? Game? Um Okay. Well, the game didn't like that one. It was weird. Give me all the fabrics and stuff. Yep, yep. How's it going, Reaper Queen? Okay. Okay, so we are currently looking for weapon crates. 
What the frick was that noise? Is that uh, like letting everybody know that I'm here? None of that. Give me this. Stop it. Okay. Reload. You reload? Oh, they jump forward a lot. Alright. Reload. Stop running at me all crazy like. Alright. You're done. You're done. Okay. We cool now? I see a crate over here though. Uh, so I definitely want to go back over here. Ain't bunker your access card. Cool. I found a bunker apparently. Eh, can I not jump through here? Can I get the. Well, there's a person! Okay, I'm fine. Oh, there is somebody else here. Arrow? I think I'm getting my arrows back, mostly. Okay. Ooh, I got new shoes. Those better than the shoes I currently had? Yes, they know. They're exactly the same. <laughs> I see absolutely no difference. Yeah, no, same. All right. I have one of the weapon and gear crates. Still one more here somewhere. Oh, I think I see it over here. It is so dark. Do I have a flashlight? B? Nope, that's melee. L? Nope, I have no idea what, what flashlight is. You know I'm here? You know I'm here. None of that. Alright, let's take you out first. First off, I could almost pick this thing up before. Man, it is so flippin' dark out here right now. Oh, of course we don't have a flashlight because we make a torch and I didn't make a torch. What does this do? I don't know exactly what this does. In for light. Oh, thank you. That's good. All right, I was gonna use this thing, but I don't need this thing anymore. Yeah. George, great. All right. Still not what I need though. Got screws. We got water bottles. All right. I didn't realize all this stuff was here. I forgot about pushing the F button or the Q button. I feel like it's up there. All right, give me, give me, give me the thing. Okay, I'll take you out. Oh, hey, how's it going? Ow. Nope. Nope, don't do that. I think I'm good. I may not be good. Happening with your body here. The things running up at me right now. I think I'm safe. Yeah. All right, we're good. Give me all the goodies in here. Another storage thing. Oh, maybe I'm not. I see that person running right now. Stop it. I'm level three. Does that mean I got new things? <clears throat> uh, no. It was hold tab, go here. And do I have, I do. Okay, so now I can unlock the thing like it wanted me to unlock before. There we go. Even with my okay, medics, now I got the disassembly thing it wanted. Anything out of thin air. We better gather some ore and logs. Okay, now it wants me to gather stuff. 
I'm busy gathering this place right now. Ooh, it goes up even higher. Oh, here we go. This is probably a good thing. Blast suit. A weapon crate? Okay, so that was the mystical crate, apparently. I'm assuming that this is the... There we go, we did it. We found everything here. <coughs> Oof. Exploration complete. All right. So did I, did it give me a new gear? Yeah, it was in for flashlight. I, I would never even have thought about that. Okay, nothing in hats. Nothing in face mask, gloves, boots, chest piece, pants. I mean, I don't even really have pants. Odds? I don't know what that means. I'm just trying to see if I can add something to, like, can I add something to this mod-wise? Modify. This. Operation slots in... Inapplicable to the current gear. Oh, sad. Can't use it on my gear. Oh, wait, I just did. I'm so confused. Whatever. In for not darkness button. <laughs> Interstation simulator, new game. I don't know. I, I don't know what game that I don't think I've heard of that one. Hey there now. None of that. I still have 21 arrows. I, don't want, I just want to go home now. Oh, you know what? Before anything, take you out. I didn't take your head off. I'm going to try to use your head against enemies and see what happens. Hey, buddy. I missed. I have my arrows back. Right. Okay. I mean, now you hear me, it's fine. I can just keep going back this way. You got Starship Simulator? Eh. I mean, the the demo I played, there was it was not so you you needed people, but at the same time, I don't know. It just it just it seemed like too much of a simulator, too sim, if you will. I don't even know if that's a good way to put it, but it's just like yeah, I don't know. It, it, there's that bar of like simulation and fun, and that one I was like, man, I feel like it's like too far into simulation. As you're trying to go for full, like, RP type of thing. It seemed really cool looking, don't get me wrong. I thought the game did seem really cool, but... Ugh. RP-wise, absolutely would be probably enjoyable. I am across the valley. Oh, wait, you want me to get... What did it want me to get? It wanted me to get gravel. Just, yeah, okay, this is fine. I can get it right here. Dude, just climb. Do it. Okay, number four. Stop, stop. Calm down. What? Does this rock not exist because I already gathered it once? I think they don't exist because I already gathered them. I'll just come down here then. It's still really early. Yeah. I mean, I did I did hear, and I actually watched it like a nine minute long video on just the overall stuff that you can do with it now. So it did seem like it would be pretty fun. But again, it just, it, it feels more for like it'd be fun with the RP aspect. It's like, I'm just gonna be a person sitting on this ship, just a normal, everyday civilian doing things. Oh, oh, I'm about to, like, 
I don't know if you die from lack of water, but it's definitely not great. Can you use this? There we go. My water is terrible right now. Okay, so I have the stuff that you want me to do. Now I can build a furnace. See, I feel like I need at least like bigger space on here, but all right, whatever, man. Facility. We'll give me a furnace and we'll just kind of place you, put you over here. No. See, I don't like this. Need my floor tiles. Sufficient materials? Oh, I don't have enough logs now. Of course. Of course, it's always something. Just chop down these trees real quick. The process goes, so depending on the role, and choose to generate tasks and problems for... Yeah, I did. I, I saw that it said, uh, like, every... It doesn't, doesn't matter which role you are. Um... You always have an adventure type of thing to go on, which I was like, I mean, I I think that sounds really fun, if it works right. All right, there we go. Just give me. I have, I have how much logs right now? Did it say 335 logs? Okay, that's a little bit more than I thought I needed or had, but that's fine. Good God. Okay, so I'm gonna put that there, put this here, put this here. I don't like that this is inside the world, but eh, what can you do? It's a little entryway right here. That as far over as I can build. And I can build right here, but I don't really want it there. Eh, that's fine, I guess. Okay. All right, and uh, I mean, I still actually have some stuff still. <clears throat> oh wait, I can get doors, right? That was only like one point. I didn't mean to push that. Get out of the way out of this. There we go. Space stuff always puts big promises though. That's, yeah, that's true. On, like, with the space stuff, too, it's, uh... <clears throat> like, they, they were talking about all the different adventures you can go out on when you're out in space. <coughs> and, like, the different factions and stuff in the game, too. Like, it, it sounds like it has a lot of premise. Or a lot of, like, potential, I guess. The game if I'm not building something. That was one of the reasons why this one stood out to me, is because it was like an MMO style type of thing with this big, huge open world. It looks really good. Yeah, as the lightning comes down, that was pretty awesome. And uh, just just some of the other stuff, like aspects of this game, it just looks really fun. I'm gonna put this right here. Furnace to refine raw materials into something more practical. We need it for advanced items. Green metals use furnace, electric furnace, and smelt ores for high level ores. You can use electric furnace. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> oh, and then there's like all kinds of stuff. We have storages, which probably gonna be useful later. Uh, private storage grade. So. Things even if there's crates. So wait, can I just like go into other people's things? I don't think you can. Can you? I thought you couldn't. Hmm. Alright. Stardust resonant filter. Storing stardust energy in other forms of matter. Oh, right? I can't. I mean, that requires things I don't even have a clue about. I mean, that's what I already have, right? That gave me that. Yeah, we have that right there. Okay, well, I gotta get a little bit more stuff because I used all of it. And now I'm happy with my space. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry. <clears throat> My god. Ah. Ba -ba -ba. I need more stone. Here we go. 
This is sulfur. This is not stone. Which I'm sure I'm gonna need sulfur too. So I guess it's probably not a bad thing to get. Right. I wonder what that is. I feel like that's a key site to go to at some point. These huge old bases. Ooh, can I like break stuff of these? No. No, I thought maybe though. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's just go back up here then. I'm just on top of the mountain. I don't know why that humors me as much as it does, but just being on top of the mountain is awesome. All right, give me all the copper ore. Some other kind of ore right there that doesn't look like copper. Nope, that's silver ore. Oh, I'm not cool enough for a silver. Okay, whatever. Okay, so I have... Like, the amount of wood I get. Yeah, I'm already like 200 and something right there. Yeah, I don't even need to keep chopping. I have so much wood. Even from perils in the wilderness. Dude, your territory. What? What? What's all that about? I don't even know what that meant. All right. So charcoal? Oh, I need charcoal for that. All right, well then, yeah, go ahead and just make me all the charcoal, I guess. Sure. Okay, didn't know that was gonna happen. Gonna go chop another tree down. How long do the nights last in this? Oh, it's 2.42 in the morning. Okay, I see. <coughs> it's holy crap. Darkness. Darkness all around. Okay, and the other one required charcoal. Alright, so I need it. I need the charcoal to go through. I need copper for that one. Alright, functional. I don't have anything else there. Power generation, outdoor. Alright, well, structures. Let's see about building these things. So, wooden door frame. Where's the door itself? Door frame 2? What's the difference? I have no idea what the difference is on these two. I'm gonna put this one right here. Wide wooden door frame, window wall. Put a window right here, sure, why not? Put a window right here too, looking out over top of the valley. All right, I'm just gonna, yeah, put it here, here. This is all this is only taking wood it looks like, which is great. Okay. Don't think I have enough to fully um I'm oh god, I would have if it wouldn't have done that. This building building is a little weird feeling. Coming from playing tons of other survivals with building aspects. Yeah, I'm out of wood. Uh, demolish? It gave me tin wood back, though. So we're good. I can finish my walls. Boom. Boom. There we go. Alright. I got myself a nice little, uh... Nice little hobble. And a tree. Okay. I thought I needed more gravel. I do not need more gravel. I just need more wood. be enough to at least finish my walls, right? I mean, not walls. Wait, how about, uh, roofs? Floors, walls, and roofs. Here. I'll probably do adjustments to this later on, but I would like to at least seal it in if I can. Mostly because it bothers me that I'm getting rained on. <laughs> I don't like that I'm getting rained on. Oh, 
Okay, slanty roofs right there. Okay, and then <clears throat> I'm assuming yeah, right here. I'm assuming they got a piece that I could put right here, and they do. Okay, so I need more logs, more logs. No, is there just a flat surface one? Or would I just use a flat surface like this? I think I would use something like this. Potentially? I don't know. That was no problem. Rain, big problem. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I don't want to be in the rain. No, I want, my, I, want, I want to be all nice and cozy. I'll get out of all this. Drop down another tree. Is the charcoal done? Oh, the charcoal's already done. Okay, it went a little bit faster than I was expecting then. Also, this one tree gives me like 150 wood, so gathering wood in this game looks like it's not going to be a problem. Oh, the stone's back again. Okay. So now I can make cock... Copper ingot? Do I want to do the copper ingot or do I want to do this first? I feel like I want to do this first. Let's put this down. Stove. Chuck gifted 10 memberships. Oh, thanks for thanks for the gifts. Gifted memberships, Woodchuck. Thank you. Definitely give him some give Woodchuck some love. Chat. You got a membership. I always look for Jarlum's name every time. <laughs> Like every time. Okay, so get out of here. Let's. I got. I'm gonna have to make more, aren't I? That's not gonna be enough. Oh, uh, 22. I mean, maybe it will be. Yeah, I feel like it randomizes it in a very, very random way. that it's a new month, right? Bam, I could do it too. Ah. This is a new month, so reset. <clears throat> I have no control over where they go though, it's just entirely random. Like I was checking to see if maybe it, it had done something, but it, it, it did not. Haven from perils in the wilderness, expand your territory, energy. I can, I can never read the second part, because by the time I, I go to read it, it's gone. Okay, so here's my question. How do I add a door? Isn't that what I got? Is it, did I only learn door frames? Door and window. Here we go. Never mind. Yay. Look, I have door. My place is secure-ish. I don't think it's just people watching. I think it's like entirely like random on. I'm pretty sure. I feel like it's supposed to be people that have at least come to a stream type of thing, but I don't 100% know. Thanks for the support for 10 months, Daisy. Very much appreciate it. So if I put this here and I put this. Rotate it. Right there. Can I... Something like this. How does that look? Does it look insane? Absolutely looks insane. But you know what? I feel like I'm out of the rain and that's all I care about. I'm happy. Also, I think this is a person, right? Oh no, that's right. This is like... like uh, you, can, you can put stuff on the ground and leave like posts for people. I forgot about that. He's streaming while painting. <laughs> it's been over 14 months. The activity thing that selects. Oh, okay. Is that what it is? 
do I just need? Yeah, I just need wood. All right, I'm gonna make myself some roasted corn. Red berry juice. Sure, I'll make that too. Okay, so we got our copper ingots. And now, can I build the thing? Do I have enough? Abilities. Uh, disassembly bench. There we go. Wait, do I, which way is the front? I don't know, I think this is the front? I honestly don't know, so I'm just gonna stick it right here, I guess. Nice. This is a strong foundation for us to build upon. I've set up a journey interface to help track our progress. For each task you complete, you'll unlock some supplies we can use. Okay. Chris so J, far, here we what go. we've got won't do much against those deviants oh, out there. okay. We need proper weapons and armor. There are some abandoned Rosetta facilities nearby. Maybe we could find some useful supply crates there. I've marked their locations on your map. Oh, there's so many things. Wow, look at this one. <laughs> Holy crap. Can I claim all these rewards? Does it just auto-claim all of them? I'm level four now. Okay, so what you're saying is I got like all these things that I can just claim and just get a ton of experience for. All right, chef, build a stove, yeah. Pathfinder. All right, cool, cool. Anything else here that I've done? Okay, check the minimap to see your current goals. Go to the monolith ruin to search for supplies. Okay, so you want me to go over there. I like how it tells me to go on the road all the way down through here and but I mean I just really run that way. We're good. So that's that's the what we're doing next is going over there. So I wanna quickly this Prince. So give me this. Ew, no, not that one. That was gross. Give me this one. Then we're gonna put this right here for our kitchen. <laughs> because I can. <laughs> no, that one's awful. These are ceilings? Interesting. I can fancify my place. I, I, I like the building that I don't need like any sort of weird paint or anything like that. I can just do that. That's all I need. Walls. I need your Oh, it's locked. I can't do it. Sad. This is our place. Your movement reminds you of the division. It, it kind of does. I mean, it, not even just the movement, the actual look of the, like, I don't know, some of the, the character, not the character art, I guess, so much as the character armor and stuff in this game. I've made myself, I've made, I've, I've made, like, a freaking back rooms, like, inside of my building right now. Good lord. All right, this is fine. This is fine. Okay, so dismantle. What can I do with you? This is simple. So I just stick all the scrap in here? Like doll. Simple? Oh, and it just gives me like the basic ingredients of everything. Okay, I see. So all that crap and random garbage I find, that's what it does. Uh, oh, hiccups. So I'm just gonna put a storage in here for now. Go, get out of this, get out of this. All right, so weight-wise. Just put all this in here. Control click. Wait, what? No, control click. Right click? How do I put you all in there? Just right click? Okay, it's that easy. Okay. 
like all that can just go in here. What is that? Yeah. I feel like I don't want to ditch that one, however, but maybe, I don't know. This. Open the weapon crate and armor chest throughout the commission task. We used to open the prime war. I don't know what that means, but all right. Do I have fire arrows? <laughs> That's no, I just have normal arrows. At least right now. Okay. Can I close the door? Does the door just closed on its own? Hello? Wooden door. There we go. I want to close it. I want to see what it looks like from the outside. It looks crazy. Climb up. So somebody could just kind of crawl into my house. Is that what I'm seeing here? No, maybe not. Like, can I just crawl in my house and get stuck? Ooh, rain collectors. This seems like something that's going to be super helpful. I should probably get... Whoa, and a bike? All right, interesting. Wait, am I going the wrong way? I'm going the wrong way. What a bike. Yeah. A bunch of people have bikes around us, apparently. Woo! Okay, there is fall damage. I do know that for sure now. My knees, oh my god, my knees are all busted up. Is that what just happened? Oh wait, I can just drink the water from here. Is that safe? What am I doing right now? <clears throat> oh, this is dirty water. Okay, so I don't want to drink. And when it says drink, it doesn't even drink. It's just gathering the water. Okay, okay. St stop, stop. We got enough water. Good guy. Well, I was under the under impression that in this game, it was like something to do with all the Stardust stuff. I mean, so vehicles didn't work, but maybe that I, I may be thinking of an entirely different game when it comes to that. <clears throat> Bam! Right, dear, I need your stuff. I'm sure. I need hide. All right, cool, cool. Flip steer. Ah, sanity gummies. What? All right, yep, sanity gummies. Seems good, there's just a big old turret here. A crazy Icarus update. I did see that there was an Icarus update last night, but I actually didn't even read what it was. Just updated. I don't trust you, so I'm just shooting you right away, instantly. What's that noise about? Okay, find Rosetta supplies in the area. Collection of six discarded items in the area. Okay. I mean, is this like one of those places that actually has something? No. This? Ah, what, 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 what is that? Oh, I pushed the E button to try to open that, and I brought my butterfly out. <laughs> now I'm just gonna go out there and kill things. Ripple in space time detected nearby. I mean, there's one of those boss creatures somewhere nearby. I think I can turn my light off. That looks good. Gardening shears. My little butterfly is freaking me out. Human process is insufficient. What? There we go. All right. 
Where's this ripple in space time? Is, some, is it this? Oh, it's probably that right there. Looks a little odd. Did I not do anything with you? I don't know what I've done. Oh, hello. Okay. I don't understand. <laughs> Whatever, man. Oh, wait, who are you? Hello? No, stop reading people's things. There's a strange woman in front of you. Get your hands off my stuff. Uh, didn't see your name on it. Uh, okay. It... You're pretty cocky for someone who doesn't even have a weapon. Hold on. Is that a cradle on your back? Interesting. I thought I was the only Mayfly left. Uh, since we're both, both Mayflies, what's your name? I'm Mary. I came here to investigate a deviation that's been causing issues. I think it's connected to a recently reopened monolith nearby. Okay. Sounds like we might be after the same thing. Don't tell me you're going to try and take on a powerful deviation barehanded. Even an ordinary deviant could tear you apart right now. For a mayfly, you're pretty inexperienced, aren't you? I'm going to give you a blueprint. Use it to make yourself a gun. While you're doing that, I have other matters to attend to. Like Once everybody's done, at like 10 times speed sometimes. It's the nearest survivor settlement. We can plan our next steps from there. After all, two heads are better than one. Like the way that the body moves is so much faster than it feels like it should be. So another mayfly survived, yet I can't remember her. My memory's been patchy ever since Matsuko revived me. Just to be safe, it's better not to share everything we know with that woman. Especially about Matsuko. That blueprint is rock Wait. solid though. We can use it to make a real I can teleport back to my base at any time? Oh my god. I didn't know about that. That is amazing. That makes me really happy. That makes me really happy. That's so nice. The disassembly bench will let you take objects you've scavenged and break them down into useful materials. Okay. Cool, cool. Take any scrap you collect and disassemble into useful materials. Okay, so yeah, it was doing exactly what I thought. So just like all. Disassemble. There we go. Alright, can I take the goodies out of here? I'm level five now. I mean, that, does that mean I have like a ton of points in this? Yeah, I have nine points in this right now. So we can copper pickaxes, which I feel like means I could probably get better stuff. Hands and marks minerals in the environment. Cool, cool. Yeah, and the ventriloquism. I, some of them seem like they talk normally. Other ones, it doesn't quite, their mouths don't quite ever move, and it's very strange. Specialization zone. Two specialization nodes that can be activated. Uh, for five levels, you unlock a new specialization node. Choose one of the four randomly generated enhancements. I don't, okay. So, facility boost. New formula. Sometimes grab when your item is in your backpack. Enjoy a small, medium chance of getting extra electronic parts when opening storage chests. Double shelf life of dishes you cook yourself. And flamethrower trap. Flamethrower trap damage 30% when a flamethrower trap kills an enemy. Uh, that seems interesting, but I kind of like this one. Long term storage. Yeah. Reset your. Okay, cool. I'm good. I don't. I don't want to reset it. I'm happy. I got. I got fancy foods now. Okay, so this gives me supplies workbench. Flamethrower, please. I can't, I'm, I'm not anywhere near a flamethrower turret. I think I saw that was like, I don't even know if it's in this, to be honest. Like, I don't know if this is even something that is possible. No, flamethrower's right there. Oh, cause I'm only level three. 
No, wait, I don't know. I'm not exactly sure what's in the game and what's not in the game, but I do see flamethrowers right here. Doves, cooking 101, yeah, 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 I'm not worried about it. Oh, wait, rainwater collection system sounds probably good. As far as building goes, stairs, meh. Basic defense. Oh, this is where it was. Yeah, there's different turrets and stuff we can have. Flamethrower trap. I don't even know where it's at. Defensive traps. Not here. Probably down at the bottom down here. Garage. Territory vehicle needs a home too, you know. Eh. I think I should probably get this. If they want me to make a weapon, I'm going to probably need ammunition. We'll learn to make basic ammunition. Gear workbenches actually unlocks me... Gun? Oh, I hope I'm not spending all the points that I need. Basic gear. <clears throat> All right, so it's better stuff. What's a fire party? <laughs> All right, so I got a few things. What does this take to make? Tell me. Details. Blueprint? Okay, whatever. Get out of this. Okay, so go to the construction mode and build a gear workbench in your territory. So this, all this stuff was what it wanted me to make. Okay, so facilities, gear workbench. I need more copper ingots. Supplies workbench. We have that. Okay, so we need copper ore and we need copper. Both of which I do not have. So out the window we go. Oh wait, 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 wait. I may have it, what am I thinking? Back in the window we go. I'm assuming it's not using stuff straight out of the chest. No, it was. It 100% is, isn't it? I don't have any wood or anything on me. Boiled water? Wrapped up that. <laughs> yeah, I probably shouldn't. Sanity gummy. It's not really a gummy. It's just meat. Uncooked meat. Uh, if you go to... Here, let's see. Uh, ba 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 I think it's until 7 p.m. tonight. I don't, it may have closed by now, but. Go. You can download the launcher from there, and I think it's as long as you have a character up or until the first 150,000 people sign up. Uh, you can get into the care, get into this, but you have to do it by today in the next, I think, five hours, four, four and a half hours. So we need to do more charcoal. I, I might as well start this right now. Wrap that up. Okay, now we need to go find some copper. Make myself an actual weapon. What I'm wondering is, this, is it? Uh, I, I, it's got. I assume it's got to keep coming back. It keeps coming back. That means there should be some over here. Yep, right here. Number four. There we go. No, not cool enough yet. <laughs> I knew that already. I don't know why I tried. Sulfur. I need to go find copper. That stone, that stone. Oh, there's some over here. Oh, there's a lot over here. Great. 
More right there too? All right, perfect. Ripple and space-time detected nearby. I don't know what that means. Like, I think that means that there's an event nearby, but I don't know exactly where or what. I guess it could be that thing over there. No. Inspection point. Or right here. Lord. Oh, that's a bad view. Okay. Or a bit hungry max AMP. Okay, well that's not good. Well, I'll eat some of this. Can I, can I eat this? There we go. And have some of the boiled water. Some more boiled water. And give me this. There we go. All right, we're all good. <laughs> I have a little bit of copper ore now, so this is great. What are you getting? Copper ore. Being weird. It's like it's trying to gather the sulfur and the copper at the same time. I have enough. I, I have more than enough. At least for the moment. Chop this tree down. I like their place. It's all up on stilts. I mean, with how easy things are to destroy and rebuild, it definitely is a thing over time. I will probably be rebuilding the base at some point into something much nicer. In a nicer area. It's not quite as full of people. But I am just starting the game, so it seems like a bad thing to do right now. All right, I'm just gonna do this because I can, and I think that's amazing that I can. you can't teleport. It's ever it's, it's timed. Oh, I thought it was gonna teleport right back. So. Not like I had to go that far, but still. How much ammo do I have left, by the way? Yeah, I only have 20. I definitely need a gun. I mean, let alone the fact that I don't think this is, like, the most powerful thing there is by far, but still. Energy hydration slows down by 80%. Oh, okay, so that's what's been saying the whole time. That is really cool. I'm totally okay with that. Okay, so you should be done with this. Go ahead and give me all that. Copper ingot. Go ahead and do all that. Craft that up. There we go. It, it's already done with all the water? That is a lot faster than I expected. I have nothing to throw in here, yeah. Alright, and then we just kind of go and put... Resources in here. Give me this. I'm going to put the copper ore in there. Let's figure out stuff I can do that cuts down on weight. It's already in here. Wait a second. All this stuff is already in here. There we go. Gunpowder is not. That's the only thing that's not. I mean, even this is probably right. Hearthstone seed. Yep. Okay. Got some more copper ingots. So can I do this now? Facilities. Nope, I still need more copper ore. I don't even think I'm gonna have enough. That sucks. It's all because of the freaking wood. I need so much wood. This is crazy. Okay, that tree's not even real. It's not a real tree. much you get from this a good amount from each tree which is great i also like the fact that i can just do this and then open up my inventory 
And it's still chopping the tree. That is such a nice thing. Happening. Go. Make it a series like Polyro? What are you talking about? You did deposit all items, but it could be merge. Yeah, I saw it looked did look like it said something about putting stuff in there that's already in there. Pause it all. Oh, okay. Well that I okay, merge items. Merge items. Yes? Okay, so I think that's the one that does it. Okay, so yes, there we go. Charcoal, craft all that. I need to craft all that stuff up. Is this enough? Did I have enough that I can do the gear workbench? Probably not. Yes, I do. I was wrong. Now put you right there. There we go. Now I want to get out of all this. I want to go to my journal. Journey thing. What is happening? This isn't what I clicked on. Why are you suddenly here? Weapon crafting. Materials. Eh? Okay. So depending on the parts I use, the better the gun, I guess. All right, cool. Whip as secondary weapon. Is that even the gun I was supposed to make, or was I supposed to be making this one? Go to the construction mode and build a supplies workbench. Oh, so I have to build a supplies workbench too? I don't have that. I need trees, and I just used them all to turn them all into charcoal. Oh my god. I guess so. Well, I think it looks like the most thing is when you when you get hungry, it said it like lowers your health. Almond tree. Do I get almonds? Oh, it looks like it just 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 wood. Finished. I mean, they still have a finished poly room. I figure when the game actually is like fully done and there's like a you know the last boss is in there then yeah maybe but right now they had there's still like no actual end to it but I was also just it really had a lack of interest towards the end. And unfortunately I gotta work with YouTube's dumb crap. Uh no. Right click. Like this doesn't seem right. It's because it's not right. I don't have any glass. Wait, I can make a wood balcony? What? Hold up. No, it did. I was afraid it would remove it. It did remove the ceiling. Sad. Wooden balcony? Can I, like, put you on here? Oh, it's, it's actually a blueprint, it looks like. No? Oh, I need copper ingots for it. Well, guess what? I don't have any. Let me put this to right there. Craft up some. All right, that's fine. Uh, build me. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna put a doorway here. If I can have a balcony, then yeah, screw it. Why not? And just give me a little roof slanty piece here, real fast. There go. Okay. Give me two copper. That's all I need. There we go. Now I can build the balcony. And I'm happy. Why? I don't know. Because it's fun. Not really a reason to have a balcony, but... Can I not put the balcony on there? Ow! Balcony. Oh. Don't want let me put the balcony on. Now I'm sad. I thought for sure I'd be able to do that. Clockwork Orange. Yes, that was the one I was trying to come up with. That's exactly it. 
That's one of the reasons I chose a little bit like tattoo right under their eye because I was like, ooh, it's like it's like Clockwork Orange. I dig it. Love that movie. I guess I have to destroy it all again because I can't put the balcony there. My entire plan is gone. So we're just slapping a wall up and then we're just putting it back on. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, and then I need the gear bench, but I don't think we have enough stuff for it yet. Oh, no, I do. All right, gear workbench is going on the other side of this thing. Great. We can use that blueprint to make both guns and ammo. If you want to make ammo, though, You'll need to do it at a synthesis bench. Copper pistol ammo? Wait, are you telling me I can only make up two of these? That doesn't seem... Gotta be more than two, of course. Alright, then you... Okay, so that's making me a crap ton of ammo. <clears throat> bizarre movie, but interesting. Oh, it is an absolutely bizarre movie. I think it's one of the reasons why I enjoy it so much. It's because it's so freaking strange and all over the place. I, I absolutely, I, I absolutely love weird movies. Just like I love weird games. There's a, there's one weird game I have right now. Actually, I wait. I think I can hit because I'm sharing my screen. This one. This is this is something I think I may do a video on. I have to wait for this stuff to craft up anyways. But you're a little Pomeranian. Basically, you just go around this house and you just destroy this entire house. It's a free game. It's overwhelmingly positive. It's free. It came out just a couple days ago. The last week or something. And you just go around and destroy everything. It looks so fun. I'm very intrigued. But I need to get up and stretch out my knee real quick. Because my knee is really starting to hurt me. Um... I already blew up my back the other day, so yeah, that's been fun. I can only move so much, but I'll be back in a minute. Uh, I... Yeah, need to stretch out my knee real quick. I do want to stream for probably at least another hour. I don't know. I don't know how long I actually have. Oh, crap. I may not have very long. I may not even have time to stretch. I mean, it may not even matter about stretching out my flipping knee. I'm going to stream this the next couple days, most likely, unless it does insanely bad. Um, I guess for now, it looks funny. It, 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 yeah, it seems really humorous. And I was like, oh, this is amazing. How many fire arrows would I rate this game so far? I'm, honestly, as far as a beta goes, this thing's better than half the freaking <laughs> games that have come out to early access. Some of them that have come out to or release lately. I think this is cool. I'm, I'm totally into it. So yeah, I'll probably be streaming more of this tomorrow. And I mean, we've barely scratched the surface of the overall map. I, I know... It's supposed to at least be this, and I know in the last beta, people spent like 50, 100 hours in this game, and they've added more to it since then. So that's one of the reasons why I'm really excited to jump into this. And yeah, like I don't know exactly when that link ends, but uh, yeah, I don't. I don't have more time. I only have like 12 minutes, so uh, I just have to uh, have to like end it in just a second. But I, yeah, I'm pretty sure that what if you go to their website, they still are accepting. You still can get keys right now. So I have what? I have a gun now. I'm intrigued on how good this gun is. Craft weapons, unlock blueprints of the gear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I feel like I'm supposed to make this. All of a log, adhesive, waste plastic. Receiver, pump action, fixed stock. This makes sense. I know it's waste plastic. Weird. Wait, tier two. Oh, it takes even fancier stuff. Brilliant crystal, bronze. Yeah, stuff that I actually don't even have. It's the only part. I could actually make a tier 2 gun if only I had one of these things. I don't think we have anything else. Crossbow. So what thing did you want me to make? Craft any weapon. I have to craft another one? Oh no! Ah! 
<sighs> Alright, well, I have pistol. Five out of five fire arrows? Yeah, I would say now. Right now, yeah. I haven't seen really... Well, I don't know. I would say it says a little bit less because it does feel... There, there has been, there's been moments. It's a beta, so I mean, I'm not expecting perfection. I would say that it still runs pretty amazingly. There's been a like a couple hiccups in the very, very beginning, but since I went to the open world, it hasn't been bad. It was weird. It was the tutorial was the part that had the weird bugs before I got into like places where there's other people, which I'd expect more issues from. But yeah, this uh, I'm pretty sure the beta goes until the end of the month, and. So there is plenty of time to go explore more of this world and get into more chaos and do more stuff. So yeah, I'm excited to try out more. Like We've barely scratched the surface of the weird creatures in this game. I've seen some of the screenshots of some things. And I'm, yeah, it's, it's, uh, I'm excited. I mean, I, what? Not that one. Nope, this. Uh, wants human. That's what I was trying to do. Whereas there's like one thing in particular that I, I want to keep on like keep on the lookout for. And I Hello? Just taking its good sweet time. What's going on here? There we go. This thing. No, that's not it. I don't even know what that is. They don't even have it. There's like a bus. There's basically a bus creature thing that like Supposedly dump stuff out. I want to see that. I'm intrigued by it. You're downloading. You're definitely gonna try it out. Yeah. I. But I'm gonna. I'm gonna stream more of this tomorrow. Uh. Thank you all for joining the stream today. I wish it could be a little bit longer, but unfortunately, Fridays I don't have as much time. But I will be streaming tomorrow and the next day. By the way, what the frick am I? Okay. Yep. All right. <laughs> thank you all for joining the stream, though. I will see you tomorrow for the same time.